Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2022. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create multiple strokes on shape layers, or how to stack strokes on top of each other, so you can create this kind of digital sticker look. So here's what we will create in this tutorial. First, I created a text layer. I converted the text layer to shape outlines. Then I nudged the individual letters a little bit to give it a little bit of variety. And then I stacked on three stroke effects. First, add some text. You can click on T for the type tool. You can use the keyboard shortcut, Command T, or right click or Control click, click on New, Text. The font that I'm using is called Londrina Solid. I'll align this to the center. I'm just gonna click horizontally and vertically. Now I'm gonna convert the text layer into shape outlines. I'm gonna right click or control click right on the layer, go to create, then click on create shapes from text. I don't need that original text, so I'm just gonna select it and delete it. To select the individual letters so I can nudge the position, for example, twirl open the outlines layer for the shapes, you will see that each letter is on its own layer. And as I'm selecting, you'll notice the bounding box is not selecting the individual layers. That's because I have the text tool selected. In order to select the individual letters, you need to select the select tool. That's the move tool in the top left. So just click on that little pointer or use the keyboard shortcut V. And now when you select any individual letter, you'll see the bounding box is on each letter. And then you can just tap on the arrow keys just to nudge them and move them wherever you want. Now I want to add the three stroke effects, but I want these to affect all of the letters. So you want to make sure you have either the top layer or the contents layer selected. And then you're going to come over here and click on this little arrow next to add and select stroke. I could repeat this process and add as many strokes as I want, or I could just come down and select the stroke and hit Command D on a Mac or Control D on Windows, and that will duplicate the layers. I'll twirl open shape one. I'll change the stroke width from two to 25. I'll click on the eyedropper tool. I'm gonna to change it to my orange color. I'm gonna change the line cap from butt cap to round cap and the line join from miter join to round join so I can smooth out the curves. I'll repeat this for stroke two and three, increasing the stroke width each time so I can see the strokes. So I'll twirl open stroke two. I'll click on the eyedropper tool and select a new color. You see, I don't see that blue yet, but once I increase the stroke width, I'm gonna change this to 65. So I'm gonna change it from butt cap to round cap, from miter join to round join. And that is how to add multiple strokes to text or to any shape layer. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.